Alright, so I just got done doing my laundry. It's still the first day, but I want to show you guys a couple things. This is blue-green algae, and I'm just preparing for the, the next day and the next couple of days, actually. Uh, this is what the blue-green algae is for. It'll, it'll go for about three, four days that I'll actually use this. And um, all you really do, it's super easy. We, we want to use the, the best water we possibly can, and I've already put everything in this that I've showed you before in, in previous videos and um, so we're gonna just load this up right here and it's just about a, um, about a liter and vortex it right in I love that vortexing motion and it uh, restructures the water alright so we're gonna take our our awesome wooden spoon and you always want to use wood with this and you don't want to use metals because with the algae and the clinking on the glass and stuff like that it can possibly um, leach metals into the whole thing so I'm gonna give you measurements because um, all the other instructions that I've ever seen you don't get measurements with this and I want to be very clear about this because if you're not very clear about this stuff, um, it will die off pretty quickly. It will die off in about two to three days if you don't do it right. So um, you got to do it right in the right amounts because um, you don't want it to die off really quickly because it literally smells like crap and you don't want to drink it because it doesn't taste as good as it, it normally does when it's alive. So you don't want that die off, uh, dying off too quickly. So you want to use the right amount. I'm using about a half a tablespoon for a liter okay so um, it doesn't really matter how um, how little the potency is but it does matter how much strength it gets so if it gets too potent like if you put too much of this in there so don't don't worry about if you put too little in but if you put too much of this in there then what will happen is it will all settle on the top and it won't be able to get oxygen um, to, to the other parts of it so it will die off really quickly and it, it really smells like crap so um, you don't want that so you don't want to put too much in and you just want to put it in there and stir it really vigorously to get these clumps out because it will clump up at the top and that's what you really don't want so you want to stir really vigorously and you can see that's not a whole lot This is going to last you a couple days. That's really not a whole lot. So don't worry about getting it not very potent because what you can always do. And there you go. Mm. Tastes super good. So now you're going to let this brew for about a day and a half. About a day. I start using it after a day just because I don't um, have enough time because I don't have two of these it would be good to get two of these about a liter each that way you can start one brew before the, the other one finishes that way it's really nice and and perfect but you really want it to, get, to at least go a day and a half before you start using it but um, I'll start using it tomorrow just because I can I mean you, you can too it's just um, you know, to, to get that beautiful blue to come out of it like that, to get that beautiful blue and purple to come out of it, you really want to um, see it's really green compared to that right now. And what will happen is the green, all the um, fibrous stuff and all the algae will settle on the bottom, and that's the die-off. And you don't, want to, you don't want to drink that. You want to get what's in it. And um, so you get that, that beautiful color. It's a lot different. So, yeah, you just... Maybe, you know, uh, tonight before I go to bed, I'm going to mix it again. Just make sure it gets mixed really well. And then you want to cover it, but you want to make sure it's still getting oxygen. So, because this still has to breathe, it still has to brew. So you want to make sure it still gets oxygen. I'm the top to this that actually allows it to get oxygen. But I'm going to put Dr. Kassar's link under this again. Um, it's in my other videos. But, um, and he shows you how to do it too, but he doesn't give you exact measurements. Um, like I do because it can die off very quickly. I've had a lot of people ask about this um, because it, it does smell like crap. 
But um, yeah, so don't worry about the uh, little potency because what you can do is you can always, you know, drink about that much water and fill up that much. And at least you didn't use that much of this and, you know, you still get this, the same vibrant color and it lasts longer and you get to use all of it instead of it dying off when it's only halfway. And then you just got this nasty smelling stuff that you can't use. So you definitely get more out of it if you just don't worry about the potency um, as to how little it is. But worry about it when you get too much. So don't just, don't do too much. Um, yeah, that's it though. That's how you make this stuff. You just let it brew. And then just like I've showed in other videos, you just pour a little bit in. And we'll do that tomorrow. And just so you guys get like an idea of uh, how strong that is, that little half a, a teaspoon that I showed you, that's about eating 34 pounds of broccoli with the chlorophyll and the amount of minerals and just the, the nutrition that's in it because it's so nutritionally dense. And um, yeah, that, that stuff is extremely nutritionally dense. It has so many things in it. You could probably live off it for a very long time. Um, so, I mean, this is, this is one really incredible superfood. And, um, Dr. Kassar says it's his favorite one that if he had to choose any of them, it would be that one. And I definitely agree with him because when you, when you drink it, you feel it and you, you feel it almost instantly. And, um, you, you, it's, it's incredible. It's a really incredible feeling. You just feel so energetic and, um, you, it just really hits you in a different way than everything else that you you, know, you, you take in. Um, so, so yeah, that would that would probably be my um, my number one choice too. If you had to get anything, it would be the AFA Blue Green Algae, and um, this one's processed a certain way so that you can brew it and you can actually get that this vibrant color out of it. This is so beautiful, and I'm gonna drink this right before I go to bed tonight. I'm just going to down this whole thing right before I go to bed tonight. So um, it's in me and um, it's washing me out while I'm sleeping. And then I'll have some water beside my bed and I'll show you that um, before I go to bed tonight.